another day and another time to walk through a spooky cemetery here in upstate New York. Today we are taking a walk through Albany Rural Cemetery. In the city of Albany, there are the original old burial ground places. When they started to develop the city, they needed to move them. So what they did was they took and dug up all of the bodies that had been previously buried there, and they put them into Albany Rural Cemetery, and that's where those people are today. I can tell you right now that it would be very easy for you to get lost in this cemetery. Some of the things that people have seen in this cemetery include shadow figures, and there are a lot of orb sightings as well. Not only have people seen shadow figures and orb sightings here, but there's also been sightings of people seeing ghostly dogs roaming. You have to wonder if that's not dogs who lost their owners and are simply just looking for them, wondering where they went off to. One of the stories that always got to me though was the fact that people have said that they have seen people walking around the cemetery in older style pajamas. They haven't said if they were elderly or they haven't said if they were young. They just have come to the cemetery and those people have been walking around here. That doesn't make any sense to me. Okay, so a minute ago there was somebody standing over here in what looked to be a red coat. And now that person is not there. And I wasn't looking away for very long. I know for a fact that I wasn't seeing things. And it's a bright red jacket. The caretaker's cottage is also a spot where people have reportedly seen some paranormal activity going on. They've heard things from inside. They've even seen people inside of the caretaker's cottage. However, there's not been a caretaker in that cottage for a very, very long time. I'm also a tiny bit concerned that I still have not come across that person wearing the bright red. One of the urban legends about Albany Rural Cemetery is that a runaway carriage came into here and the horse smashed his head into one of the headstones and died. That horse is now buried in this cemetery and people who have visited have said that they have heard the ghostly horse footsteps at night when they've been in the cemetery. We're over by some mausoleums right now, and last time that I was here, I just got a real negative feeling being in this area. So I'm gonna break out the EMF, see if I can get any readings and see what happens. have to come back here another day because there's a lot more that I'd like to see. There's a lot more that I'd like to have the EMF out for and try to discover if some of these urban legends and ghost stories are actually real from this cemetery. I don't know what to make of this, but I was walking back to my car and the EMF started to go off. And then I just got this real weird feeling and it felt like somebody was walking with me and for a consistent time, the EMF was going off. And that is just, just a spooky experience that I'd like to share with you guys. It's not going off now, of course. It was just a very, very eerie thing that was just happening here. The closer that I'm getting back to walking to my car, the more the EMF is going off. I'm wondering if there's somebody here that doesn't want me to leave. Maybe they want to hang out. Is there somebody walking with me? Well, I'm gonna go now. If you want me to stay, you can, why don't you make my little device go off? Come near me. That is just straight up weird. That is straight up weird. But Albany Rural is definitely one of those places you need to come and check out.